There's been something on my mind for a little while lately, man, and I really want to include you guys in this. I really think it's time to mature this channel a little bit. Mature the channel like a fine Matt LeBlanc, if you will. How you doing? In order to do that, a certain figure has to mature themselves. Me. And what better way to secure that than to pour some fine, matured wine on my sneakers to make them more fucking expensive. And now a word from our sponsors. Are you guys sick and tired of striking out, taking L's on every supreme drop imaginable? Every easy drop, every hype sneaker drop that you try to get, people beat you in the checkout process? Well, me too. That's when I actually, and I'm being real with y'all for a second, I found out Checkout Kings. Now, Checkout Kings is a website, this is actually sponsored by them, by the way, I appreciate you, is one of the normal bot services that you hear about. However, what I'm introducing you guys today is their sneaker Bible. Now when I say sneaker Bible, this is actually 85 pages of industry secrets from people that have actually successfully checked out all those hype pieces and stuff like that and how they've done it to the exact detail. This thing's crazy, bro. I actually heard about it and I said to them, yo, if I could plug you in a video, can I have this for free? And they did it. So thank you guys so much for that. They give you so much information, how these bots actually work, how to actually use them. Like I said, how to actually auto check out, which I really wanted for more Supreme drops, which is why I'm really into it. There's actually a discount right here for 20% off if you guys want to join it. I recommend it. Check out Kings. We appreciate you. Link down below. Now back to our scheduled programming. First things first, man. Go get yourself a bottle of hyped up wine. We're doing a fucking custom. So for the viewers, of course, what uh -huh. do you look for first when you're picking up a wine? A fine wine. A fine wine, yes. Uh, the main thing that I usually look for, I'm not you no know, connoisseur, but I am. A uh, nice tit on the bottle. Tit? A nice tit. What do you mean? Like uh, in the logo, you know, like the, a naked woman? Like or? a cork. I don't think that's what they the, say at all. It's just called the cork. I don't think so. I think you're wrong. Uh, usually when you're looking at a nice bottle of wine, which is what we're after today, of course. Uh, if you want a nice shoe, uh, make the shoe more expensive, look for a nice tit. Now, a lot of people don't know the tit of the wine, aka the cork, says how good the wine is. Okay, that's fair. I, I can see if, where that... If the cork looks fancy and it's maybe a gold cork or a black cork, right. it's a good one. So good a big black tits, cork. Good wine. Okay. Uh huh. Another thing you want to look for is the uh, the waves in the penile region of the wine. So the penile region of the wine is the bottom part of the wine. I now when you good. shake it in the store, you should see nice waves along the bottom of the wine. AKA the bubbles as you shake should rise, I wouldn't say fast, but somewhat fast. Somewhat in what I call penile, somewhat of a cum if you will. Not fast, okay. but steady flow. All right. Of the wine bubbles. Not rushed though, just. No, not rushed at all. It's kind of so quick. The two terms you want to look for when copping a bottle of wine, if you will, the tit and the penile region of the wine. Perfect. How's that one looking? You know, it's really good. If yeah. You see the bubbling coming up here? Yeah. Some nice speed. That's what we call the penile region, of course. Right. Can I help you guys with anything? No, I think I'm good. I'm actually yeah. teaching him a little bit. Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, teaching him just. The fine About wines. the wine. Okay, just be careful because we're actually not supposed to take pictures in here. Okay, okay. yeah, no problem. Okay, thank you. Absolutely. It's for his records. Tit looks nice, penile region looks nice. It's a fine model. Expensive, okay. actually. Perfect. It's kind of funny how that's a really good one because it's also one of the cheapest. Yeah, no, that's fine. Yeah, it's good. It's expensive. It's on sale. There's no cork in there, dude. What happened to the tit? Well, it's one of those fine metallic twist offs. It's, uh, it's a rare tit. It's oh. a good bottle of wine. All right. Yeah. I'll trust Should we you. go? Should That's we get it. this custom going? Let's do it. Actually, to show you guys, man, here's a legit check. Everyone always asks. One thing that I can really help to prove, I don't know if this helps you guys, I've been wearing these a little bit, and I don't wear fakes. I actually have real Yeezys, so I don't need to do that. These are real. You can tell there, here. Dear legit, I don't give a fuck if you believe it or not, but they're real. Now let's go to the fucking custom, bro. All right. You ready for the music? Yeah. Okay. Three, two, one. <laughs> My boy. My boy. We got something special to show him or what? Maybe. This well, turned out dope, man. What time is it first off, though? It's time for Chillin' with Name Brand. Chillin' with Name Brand. If you guys don't know this segment, this is where we try to get the video to 10 minutes so we can get more ad revenue, more on the recommended feed, and also we could talk to you guys a little more. It's also uncut for my own editing pleasures, and if I say anything stupid or he does, we can't take it out, and if we go to jail for it, sick, we'll vlog it's never that. never been, it's never been. <laughs> Y'all ready to see this, huh? Blah. The fu oh, fuck you, Light. The fucking 
red. Okay, that looks a little there better. There we go. Holy fucking shit, this turned out dope. Good. This turned out real sick. Now, funny story behind this one. We actually did this on stage in LA. Yep. First with a, um, with like an NMD. And we hadn't done it before, so of course we tested it on stage in front of like a hundred people. Yeah. <laughs> it worked out, so fuck it, man. We're gonna do it with this one. So this is an all purple. I've, I've never seen anything like it. I, I call like it, it the Rose Yeezy. Honestly. The Rose I think Yeezy. That's sick. I like that. I like that a lot. It wasn't Rose though. It was red, but it looks Rose now. Yeah, it looks purple. It's really sick. Anyway, let us know down below how that turned out. Also. If you guys want a cleaning video of this, I've been doing lots of cleaning, like testing lately, because I have no product from Rejuvenator or crap or anything in my stock. I've been cleaning everything myself. If you guys see us doing crazy customs and shit like that, I always clean out the shoe. Like this one's about to get cleaned out and used again. That's how we do so many of them. I can't like afford one pair of shoes per video. Yeah. So if you guys want a cleaning video with this, I'll show you how to get this out without any products, nothing. And I guarantee you we can do it. So if you want that, leave a comment down below. You're laughing. This is when you start your new company where you clean shoes. Yeah. <laughs> Only soap and water it's going to be called. Brand new. That's Brand what it's called. Brand new. Oh, Brand shit. New. Oh, shit. Brand yeah. new. And we just sell cloths pretty much. I'm patenting that. I'm patenting that. Patent Fuck now. you. You're not getting any of it. So actually, we are going to cut this out. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> shit. <laughs> now we cut. So we're going to call it a... Uh, Rishuvenator. Rishuva Brandon. Yeah, there we go. Rishuva that's Brandon, actually that's a perfect name. Anyway, man, that's how it turned out. Let us know down below what you think about it. Would you do it yourself? And if you do, I got an Instagram right here, bro. He does too. Absolutely. Shout it out to us. You can do it on your, any white sneaker you fucking have. Mm -hmm. You don't need Yeezys. Be I wanted to do it on these, though, because they got the all gray ones coming out. I'm like, those ones look fucking stupid. Did you see that? And they got uh, this shoe. Well, it's actually the Beluga 2.0. Oh, but Beluga. It's yeah, like, yeah, yeah. It's fucking just gray. It's yeah. a gray zebra. It looks that's, retarded. That's stupid. But except the uh, the boot or this part right here, the sole, There's whatever the fuck that is, it's like gray too. So it's yeah. kind of chill. It's gay. It's stupid. It's awful. <laughs> Usually I'd cut so out the dumb. word gay because I don't try to use that. But anyway, there we go, man. I think it's dope. Honestly, mm -hmm. I could fucking do this like purple too. I think yeah. that look really sweet. But once again, man, let me know if you guys want a cleaning video. I'm about to clean it anyway, but if you want me to show you guys how I actually do it with no fucking product, None. you don't need to pay money for it, except I'm getting sponsored by a cleaning company soon, so <laughs> that'll be a different so story. I'll tell, you, oh, cleaning product. I'll, I'll tell you that. I'll tell you it's better soon, but uh, that turned out nice, man. This is gnarly. If you want to see dope pictures of it, we took some cinematic shots. Oh, I yeah. did, actually. You just sat back and said nothing. Then it's on my Instagram, man. Of course, y'all know the name brand fam is real, real strong. I'm looking at the time, and I think we should do another, fuck, another minute for another sure. Minute. Another minute for sure. What else do you, you want to say something, don't you? Let me know, actually, too. If you guys like chilling with name brand before wasting time, it's still going to be a thing. I'm still going to do it, but yeah. you let them know, man. I'll no, put this centerpiece right here. Right there. What do you got to say? I mean, just follow me on Instagram, baby. Jesus Christ. Right Every time, I gotta stay consistent. Of course, Persistence yeah. is key. Awesome. Yeah, right there. I'm at like 1,400 followers right now. That's Very good. happy. I'm at, did you see I hit 50,000? What? No, you didn't. I, I hit 50,000. When? On Instagram. I have not like, seen this. While I was at the lake. Yeah. Wow. We well, look said, at that news right there. Congratulations. 50,000, bro. Blah. Just boy. like that. Now I can go up to girls in the club and I'll be like, hey, I got 50,000. They'll be like, what? I'll be like, what is that? Did you say 50? <laughs> I'll be like, dollars. $50. <laughs> I think that's better. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, man. This thing turned out fucking sick. I really encourage you guys to do it because I want to see some pictures. And actually, if you do do it, how about I post it on my Instagram? You gotta take a good picture of it though. Look at my Instagram, look how the pictures are. I don't want in-hand shot in your basement with yeah. the carpet in the background, your <laughs> dildo on one side of the screen and your baby sister crawling on the other side. <laughs> I want a sick shot and I will repost it on a 50,000 follower Instagram account, Okay, bro. now it's going to raise your head. <laughs> no, I, no, I own that. <laughs> Wait till we get to 100,000. I'll unfollow everyone, I don't <laughs> fuck. <laughs> wow, that's it. I think we're good with the 10 minute portion of this oh, video. Oh yeah, I think we'll be fine. You think so? Yeah. I mean, we do it to talk to y'all, but we also do it for money. A lot of money. That you don't see. But, that uh, I, yeah. <laughs> For his money. For my money. This is charity, what I'm doing right here. No, I fly, I fly him out to sneaker cons. I pay for half your trip. Shh. Every time. Shh. Shh. That's not his own and money, And full baby. sometimes. That's not his own money. Name brand. Cameraman Adam, live in the flesh, signing out with another video. What do you got to say, bro? Honestly? Just... Blow! And then... I want to say it first, because we always do it like... No, I'm not going to cut it yet. Fuck. <laughs> okay. And sit awkwardly. Blow, bitch. <laughs>